Joe Ledoux posits a two-pathway or dual-pathway model of fear, and he basically argues that there are two different pathways in the brain by which emotions can be processed. Now let me go ahead and zoom in here. He calls these two pathways the low road and the high road. So if we're looking here, uh, here's this girl on the trail. She sees uh, what looks like a snake here. First, information, visual information, comes in through the eye, okay, and it goes directly to the amygdala, okay? You'll remember that the amygdala is critical for um, emotional responses, okay? Basically, this information um, is processed immediately in the thalamus and the amygdala, and it permits an immediate behavioral reaction, okay, increase heart rate, increase blood, pl blood pressure, and our muscles contract, all of these are useful for mobilizing us to respond and avoid the threat. Okay, so this is the low road bypassing the cortex. It's quick, it's fast, it's emotional, and it permits a fast adaptive response to the situation. Now, the higher road, okay, up here, um, this basically leads to the cerebral cortex where the message can be interpreted more carefully and more in depth. Okay, we're able to more carefully evaluate what's going on. Um, so the idea here is that it's adaptive information to come in and basically be processed immediately and quickly from a standpoint survival. And then later on, okay, we can process it more cognitively um, up in the cerebral cortex. Okay, um, this is basically his model, this two... A road or dual theory model of how the brain processes emotion. And he is a famous emotion researcher. You can hop on YouTube and see various talks that he's given. Uh, but this was a major prominent model that came out in the early 2000s about how the brain deals with emotional events. Okay, and you should be familiar with it.